You have to take a look at future growth and where we're going. And I think we've got a great growth story. You know, we've, uh, first of all, we've got a fantastic team that we've assembled over the past three or four years. We've come out from COVID uh, like a shotgun and the company continues to grow. And we think there's even more growth embedded, not only in the organic existing portfolio, but in the new assets that we just purchased and the Nashville asset that we took out of the ground uh, last quarter. Now, it's important when you discuss the new assets that they haven't been tangerized yet, I'll say, meaning that they may have some custom, some open spaces that you can put uh, new tenants in, or they may have, say, I, I don't want to pick on anybody, but Express just filed for uh, bankruptcy. Maybe they've got something where you can actually do an upgrade. Just because you lose a tenant does not mean that you're necessarily longer term going to do worse. In some cases, you're going to be doing better. Well, I think some of the reaction is to the fact that we've traditionally, at least over the last couple of years, have renewed existing tenants at a rate of about 95 percent. So when a, a deal comes up for renewal, we get significantly higher rent but we've been willing to renew that tenant. Now what we're saying is there's more upside in replacing a tenant that may be oversized, that maybe hasn't invested in their store, whose sales maybe have started to decline. So it's up to us as stewards of our property, as general merchandise managers of our assets, to go out there and replace certain tenants with higher, better producing tenants. And the upside there is we're not getting rid of that tenant. Right. Maybe we're downsizing them and putting them someplace else in the shopping center. And when they move in the shopping center, you get a new store, a new concept, a right size store, and perhaps you get better productivity out of that asset as well. Okay. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on X. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Mentions. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.